the ultimate strobe light you'll ever need. Cue intro. Hello everyone, my name is Omar Hamouda. I'm a content creator here on YouTube, and I'll be talking about the FJ400 and my experience on using this strobe light. Now, I'll be honest with you guys, this is the only strobe light I've ever used in my life. Reason being is that I never really understood how lights or strobe light works in general. I know how natural photography works, like when it comes to natural lighting, using the using golden hours as peak lighting, and also using night lights and all that stuff. It was kind of hard to understand how these strobes work. So just an easy way out is I don't use them. Not until I got into the studio and started doing fashion shoots, uh, product shoots and stuff like that, I really understand how to use these. The reason why FJ400 is a great strobe light is for the one convenience is that it's portable. This is your battery and these are the controls. You use them via remote. I'll just say this right off the bat is that this is by far the easiest strobe light I've ever used in my life. And maybe there's other ones that are easier, but this one comes, well, it doesn't come with it. It comes separately, but you use this, you use this, and you can attach virtually as many strobe light as you want. I actually have two more of these because of the convenience of it being portable and how to use these things are relatively easy. So all you gotta do is turn on the remote. You make sure to put on the settings of your camera, which I'm, I usually use a Sony camera. Make sure that this is turned on. And all you gotta do is pair it to its channel. And, well, that's, that's it turning it on. All you gotta do is pair it to the channel and make sure that the grade or the GR, I usually say grade, I don't know why, but the grade is to it. So check this out, ready? So I don't know if you see that number right there, it's 3.3, 3, right? So if I go down to change the number of it, right? See that? I'm changing it. See, my hands are away, just using the remote, just using the remote, changing it up, changing it down. It's relatively easy, that is. And you can actually turn it on as a modeling light. I've been asked before, should you use it as a video light? Absolutely not. Hear this. That fan is loud. You would not use it. This will cost you up to $5.99 here in the US. Um, anywhere else, you probably just have to convert it. This, I believe, ran me up $200 which isn't bad because you only need one of this and virtually you'll need more of these to come. And honestly, it comes with a convenient bag. It comes with this bag, right? Convenient, you just plot that in, take this off, put it in here, take this, put it in here, and the remote, just drop it in, convenient fits, and Close. And that's it. To be honest, there's a lot of strobe light options out there. But for me, this is the best one I've used so far. And it might be the best one for you. You'll never know. You just gotta try. So if you like this video, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell notification to know when I post more. And thank you for watching, and see you all next time. And that's it.